Hello, my name is Quentin Brown from Web Marketing for Profit. And in this short tutorial, I want to introduce you to digital magazines. We run a very successful web marketing business and we have customers all over the world. And we're always researching ideas to help them reach new markets and get new customers. So we've done this research. We found that there are over 350 million tablets in the marketplace, both Android, Apple iPads, Microsoft, and a number of others. And all these people are looking for great content. And one of the forms of content they like to read is these digital magazines. So we're going to show you how to create your own digital magazine and reach millions of hungry readers. While digital magazines have been around for quite a while, Apple recently re released the newsstand where magazine producers can upload their magazines so people can read them on their iPads. Unfortunately, most traditional magazine producers have no idea of how people read magazines on tablets. So they just take their traditional magazine, turn it into a PDF and upload it into the newsstand. And as you can see on the left there, it's very hard to read. They have multiple columns, page spreads, etc. So what we did was a little bit different. What we want to show you is how to create a magazine that will look good on a tablet. We produced our first magazine called IM Magazine, which is an internet marketing magazine. And we were surprised at the response we got and the number of downloads we got from this magazine. Our approach is a little bit different to a traditional magazine in that we make it much easier to read and provide a better experience from the reader on all platforms, not just Apple. So people can download this magazine and read it on a range of different tablets. And as you can see on the left there, we don't use multiple columns. We try and keep it down to one or two columns for much easier reading without having to do any scrolling or zooming to read the content. Digital magazines are great because within a magazine, there's lots of advertising, etc. And the beauty of a digital magazine is these can all be links. So you can promote your products, your services, you can promote affiliate products, turn it into a PLR product, you can update your customers, you can dominate a niche with a magazine, reach mobile users, reach tablet users, reach desktop users, you can use it to build your list. And once you develop a good following, you can also profit from offering advertising. What you won't have to do is jump through all the hoops with Apple unless you choose to. So on the left there, you see that we've got an advertisement for web hosting. In the yellow area, we're promoting some of our products and services. And so it's a great way to develop a good following, provide excellent information, and get your information to a whole range of customers that you might have not been able to reach before. You can produce these magazines for yourself or for your customers. In this course, you will discover how to make the cover of your magazine. Now, this is a part that scares a few people because traditionally you'd have to get a graphic artist to do it all for you. And that can cost around five to six hundred dollars. However, we're going to show you a very simple way of how you can create your own magazine covers using Photoshop. Now, you do need Photoshop for this because you need the layers, etc., to be able to produce a good looking magazine. However, once you see our tutorial and how easy it is, you'll be able to do all sorts of things. Now, a few of our test students didn't have Photoshop, and so we encouraged them to go out and find someone who did and just use their Photoshop for half an hour. It's not going to take you a long time to produce these covers once you see how to do it but you would need Photoshop to do it to get the best results. And we're going to show you a really simple way to do it. The next thing we're going to show you is how to find great content without having to write it all yourself. Now, it's good for you to write some of the articles or information. However, we will go through and show you hundreds of different places you can get great content for your magazine.
Next we'll show you how to format it all so it looks good and reads good on a tablet. We'll show you different ways you can put it all together for the best reading experience. Once you've created your magazine, there are hundreds of places you can put your magazine so people can download it. So we'll go through a whole lot of different places and how to distribute your magazine. In this course, we also want to provide a forum so you can collaborate with others and share and cross-promote your magazine. So we want to build a little community of digital magazine producers so we can share new places to distribute our magazines. Maybe you have a magazine that fits in with mine so I can then offer your magazine within my magazine and we can start collaborating together. So that's a little bit about what we're going to offer you in this course. And if you have any questions, please feel free to contact us. My name's Quentin Brown from Web Marketing Pro Profit. I'm really looking forward to working with you and helping you create your own digital magazines.